Hi, my name is India Artis. I'm from the Bronx, New York. And I had keratoconus. I found out about Dr. Brian Boxer Watchler through like major research online and everything kept leading back to Dr. Brian Boxer Watchler. So I decided to further look into him and I find out that he's actually the best at what he does at treating keratoconus. So my family and I, we uh, we did so much to get here. We did like GoFund pages and donations from all kind of things, from bands to shirts, all kind of things. And we made it here. And before being treated by Dr. Brian Boxer-Washla, my vision was really blurred, triple, double. At night, I like to describe it as everything sort of looked like Christmas lights. And um, now, this is just one day <laughs> after the surgery, and this is like amazing. Everything looks like HD, <laughs> high def, and kind of like 3D. And this is just in one day. It's still a little, a little blurry in the, the right eye, which was, uh, had the keratoconus, was the worst in this eye. So it's still a little blurry, but I had the cross-linking done, which is to bring the keratoconus to a halt. And then the intacts, which are these round plastic rings to kind of flatten the cornea. And then I had the CK procedure to correct the vision. So those things combined gives me this. <laughs> so um, I'm also probably, uh, sometimes some patients after everything is said and done, you may need glasses or contact lenses. So I'm one of them who would need glasses and or contacts, which I'm gonna do the contacts and I'll take that over everything I've been through. So the contacts is, it's not that big of a deal for me. But I really encourage people to take a visit to the doctor and get these eyes checked. And God forbid, but if it leads to keratoconus, this is your stop, your number one stop. This is my best friend, Brenda, and she can tell you a little bit about <laughs> how things were for me from traveling in the morning when I leave out for work, because it was pretty dark, all the way down to cooking, how I would have to chop things like this and yeah, all the way up to her confidence, mm -hmm. which she received back yesterday yeah. after the procedure, um, came back to herself. Now she's smiling a lot and happy about going outside and not worrying about her balance being off and bumping into things like that. So very, very proud. And to be there in the room as he's doing the procedure was amazing, amazing right? to actually see it was really 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 amazing i mean he was so confident i was i was even looking for his hands to be shaking and they weren't i mean like i think even if i was doing something for like a hundred years i still would be nervous because i'm dealing with someone else's eyes and he was not nervous nothing just went through that like it was nothing so he is very experienced and like she said i would recommend him to anybody that has this disease so he's the best at what he does thank <laughs> you dr brian boxer absolutely we thank you <laughs>